waking up two days after Easter training at a brother's house, Gilly, and um, feeling good. I'm at where they would call place Paradise Point. So today we are going to take a ride on the quad brother trip to another brother's home where we're going to see what's new in his life and the developments on his land and uh, what's going on, what he's offering in these parts of uh, Costa Rica. So join us. So this is Gilly and this is Nimrod. Say hi to the world. Hi, hi world. So the gear is going up. Ah, so I'll, uh, Ella, you can drive. Yeah. You okay? Comfortable? Yeah. So he's saying that's his first time driving this one. This is the brake? Yeah. What is in my leg here? Nothing. Nothing? Up, up or down? Hello. How are you feeling, guys? You should awesome. go, Frank. Your 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 nuts, your, your penis. Everything's good. Everything. You, you know, when all you walk, the good, you all the go goods are, are in place. Huh? So, what's Shlomo's place called? Ayala. 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 No. Yoga ceremonial. Good times. With with showers and toilets. Really. Yeah, over there, showers and toilets, all from the well. Temple space. Full, beautiful, beautiful place. Everything you need in the most simple way. Exactly. Oh, exactly. Yeah, this is and in the middle of trees and nature, waking up in the forest, going to sleep in the forest with glamour. So Which actually, you can hear the ocean from the casitas mm. in the night. And look at uh, And it's an easy. Hello, beauties. Hi. Yes! Hello! Hey, Hello! Hey. Hello! Oh, it's a reunion! Hello, yeah. Motek! What a surprise, brother! Mm. <laughs> wow, it's really cool! <laughs> Living in nature, nothing beats it. It's 
especially when it's accommodations like this. Woof. Yeah, this is the family place. Yeah. This is Nitsa. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Who am I talking to? You talk to the world, so it doesn't talk back, actually. <laughs> but it does in the comments. So, yeah, Nitsa, tell me about uh, where you're from and what you're doing in the world. Ah, I'm walking the path. Um, Walking the path of the heart. Mm. I have a place in Colombia, a lovely family. Um, it's a place to host people, invite them to come, open their hearts. Um, so we do retreats, and I'm a, an Easter fan. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm realizing that one of my biggest goals is to be to raise the next generation mm. in this time being. Mm. You know, it's really one of my uh, my main presents, you know, gifts to give to the world. And for me, it's one of the most important things is mm. to raise the new generation in a very conscious way. So if you're going so to Colombia, if you come to Colombia or you go to Colombia, I'll get put you in touch with Nitsan. He's got a beautiful place to stay on the land. Similar to this, what's going on here. But yeah, what is it called? Espacio de Manja. There Look you go. for us on Facebook. Thank you. <laughs> so we're here with Shlomo, the grand founder of this beautiful place. What's the name? What does it mean to you and why did you start this? Alia okay. is the name of the place, Alia Retreat Center. Mm -hmm. And uh, Alia means elevation in a couple of uh, languages, in Hebrew and Arabic and also in Sanskrit. Mm. Why did I start this place? Yeah. I have no idea, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> I came here to Costa Rica to visit for a week. Mm. I fell in love with every aspect of it. From the airport, the people, the plants, the animals, the land, the air, the ocean. Gives me a lot of freedom and opened my heart instantly mm. in a big way. Mm. And I bought the land. I think it's basically, if I look back, it's listening to the steps that I took, listening to the environment the nature and then slowly slowly I don't know if making a decision but going to that place of making it available for everyone. Alia offer work, work exchange, uh, uh, offer its space for uh, just people who like to come and rent a casita mm. for a night or for a week or more and just relax and enjoy the environment. If they're renting a car they can go to the villages and have dinners and so on. If they, will, if they would like, they can stay here and eat with us. Mm. Uh, retreats that are uh, happening more and more often. Uh, mm. All different retreats for yoga and some shamanic. Mm. We are offer also mm. personal retreats. Mm. People come here and they do some juices, yoga in the morning, in the evening some silence, some meditation. Mm. So, and they can actually create their own uh, personal retreat. Wow, that's yeah. beautiful. We that's offer beautiful. every day uh, yoga at 7 a.m. You know, different teachers, depends who are here in this time. So... And how many people can you have on your land here at the same time? Uh, 25. Really? Yeah, 25 people. What's the best way to get in touch with you? Call me. Call or send me an how email. How do you find you, like Airbnb? Alia Retreat, Alia Retreat Center. So Alia is A-L-Y-A? Yes. Alia Retreat Center. Alia Retreat Center dot com. Learn more about Shlomo and yes. his project. Yeah. Book some time here. I yeah. spent some time in a casita here and it was beautiful and perfect. And there's a beautiful beach down the way called San Juanillo. Yeah. So check it out. Yeah, definitely. And everything that you see here we build ourselves. All the wood comes from the land. Everything we build ourselves. We cut each tree, we haul it on our shoulders, we peel it, we cure it, we slice it, and we build with it. Lots each, of love. Lots yeah, of, lot love of love here. Lots yeah. of love here. So check it out, and I'm going to go check out the other spots. And um, yeah, until next time, remember, let love free. It's the only way we'll ever change anything and make a difference. Amen. Satnam.
Come, she got my love. Come, she got my love. Come, she got my love. 